Is the HyperX SolarCast worth $50 or not? Let's talk about it. What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're actually gonna be reviewing the HyperX SolarCast microphone. I know I'm a little bit late to the party. This microphone came out in November, 2020, but you know, I'm getting into more microphone reviews lately. This microphone has been on my mind for a while, so I ended up actually buying this. This was not sent to me to review. Um, this microphone sells around $40 to $50, $60, depending on the sale. I actually was able to buy it around $35, open box, brand new. I don't really need it, and I'll probably just end up giving it away to one of you guys or on TikTok, so make sure to go follow that or join Discord as well. The microphone itself looks really super, super sleek. In the front, you get an LED light that will tell you if the microphone is active or not. And on the top over here, there is an actually a tap to mute button, which is really, really nice, especially at this price point. The cable that comes in the box connects via USB-C to USB-A to your PC. The length of the cable is two meters, which is around 6.5 feet so yeah overall it looks really really sleek and super super nice it'll look really nice on your desk and super clean the microphone itself comes with this stand that the microphone just slips in right here the one thing that i do not like about this stand is that it tilts only a little bit this is the maximum tilting you're going to be getting you can't go any further than that all the way to the back i think this microphone is also meant for mounting because on the bottom of the microphone you can see there's a hole that is ready to be mounted on a boom arm the microphone itself is going to be using a polar pattern for picking up your audio let's go ahead and plug it into my pc and do some audio tests on it uh yeah let's go in three two one Okay, test number one for the HyperX SolarCast is gonna be an audio test. I'm gonna just talk to it and uh, act like everything is normal. What is going on, guys? My name is Give Him Chills. We are testing the HyperX SolarCast. This microphone is a great microphone that uses polar pattern audio pickup systems. When I'm about, I don't know, seven to eight inches away from it. I'm gonna get a little bit closer, test the audio. What is going on? Does it sound good or bad? Yeah, 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 yeah. Obviously, as you can see, it's going to pick up the audio from surrounding of the microphone, which is really, really nice. I hope this microphone sounds good and not too quiet. Is it too quiet? I don't even know. Is it? Test number two is going to be a background noise test. I'm going to shut up and see how this microphone sounds in three, two, one, and silence. In test number three on the HyperX SoloCast, we're going to be testing a keyboard in front and behind the microphone. So if you're a streamer or if you want to record your keyboard noises or whatever you do on TikTok, this would be a test for you. So let's go ahead and test that in three, two, one. And we're going to switch. Yeah, guys, he's still left to the right. I'm not really sure. That was it for the tests. I'm going to pause right here, go and listen to the audio on my computer, and I'll let you know if I like it or not. All right, so I'm back and I have some thoughts. I'm personally pleasantly surprised by how good this microphone sounds. It's going to pick up enough bass and enough of your audio to make it sound really, really good and rich. At the same time, it keeps it really, really clean. The background noise test was not too bad, not as bad as I expected it to be, but the keyboard noise was horrible. Obviously, maybe I have it too close to it, and that was the issue. This microphone is not meant to be close to keyboards. So if I was you and I was using this microphone, I would 100% put it on a boom arm. Do not just use it on this like that first of all it's going to pick up a lot of bass so if you tap or hit your desk it's going to be picked up instantly by this microphone put it on a boom arm do not put it on a desk that's just my thoughts the tap the mute functionality at the top is really really nice i really wish that this microphone did have a knob at the front so you can adjust the gain on the fly that is the one thing that i feel like this microphone is missing because of the same price point other microphones from companies like fifine do have that but yeah those were my thoughts about the hyperx solocast overall it's a great microphone is it worth 50 dollars 100%. It's really, really good. That was it for the HyperX SolarCast review. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed it, drop a like, please, to the Razer Siren Mini. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye.